Hi, this is Gary with Mac Most Now. On today's episode, let me show you how to recreate those Finder sidebar items that show you your most recently used documents. So back in Leopard and Snow Leopard, you had some items on the sidebar of your Finder window that showed you uh, documents that you accessed today, yesterday, last week, all sorts of different things. But these are gone in line. But they're easy to recreate because they're not really anything special. All they are are smart folders with searches in them that show you these documents and then those are placed in the sidebar. You can easily recreate those in Lion if you want them back. So here in the Lion sidebar we don't have those items but we can create them very easily. The first thing we need to do is to create these folders that will be searches. In our Documents folder let's create a special folder here just to contain these. Uh, let's call them uh, sidebar folders and inside that we'll have that selected and say create a new smart folder. Now this new smart folder is going to be a search here. We're going to search for and add a criteria and say that the last open date was within the last one day. Or you could say simply today. Let's do that. And we see a sample here of what we've got um, and then we'll hit save. And then we're going to save that to that documents folder into the sidebar folders thing and we're going to call it today. And we'll save it in there. And now we can see there it is today.saved search. So we can see it added the save search to my favorites list here on the left. And so I've already got it. I can just click on it and I can see files that were opened today. Another thing we can do is if we don't want to have a whole bunch of these on the left, we can drag the entire folder in here and stick it in. And then we could take this one and remove it by uh, removing it right here, move from sidebar. That way we could click on it and easily access, say if I'm using column view, which I like, uh, all these saved searches very easily. So let's create another one. Uh, we'll do a new smart folder and this time we will have it be that the last modified date is within the last 10 days and in addition to that we want to make it kind as document only so only recent documents and we'll do save we'll go up to the documents folder and put it in our sidebar folders there and call it recent docs so now it adds it to the sidebar here we can adjust it we can go to either one of these or we can go to the sidebar folders here to see them in column view a little easier. Either way that you prefer it. So you can create all sorts of different ones. For instance, uh, it, under new smart folder we can easily add in um, for kind all sorts of different things. So uh, music, images, um, presentations. Uh, we can change to the last open date, last modified date, last created date, uh, all sorts of different things like that, even uh, names. So if you're naming files with the names of a project you can put that all on the sidebar too. And then the great thing is of course these things automatically update. So here is uh, today's opened things and if I go and open say uh, address book here you can see it added address book here to the most recent items. So that's a handy thing if you want to recreate those sidebar folders or you just want to create completely new ones uh, that meet your own criteria. It could be very useful. Till next time, this is Gary with MacMos Now. Want more video tutorials? Just go to MacMost.com, click on the videos link at the top of the page, and then you can view all of the hundreds of MacMost videos by category.